Hi everyone, welcome back to Equipoise Classes and I Surpi Gupta welcome you all in Mission CUET 2024 series. So we are in our week 3 and our theme is actually this whole week ka jo theme rehne wala hai guys, that is going to be money and banking. So money and banking is our theme for this particular week and uh, this is part 11. Uh, you know of this particular series and also we have a playlist everybody so if you guys miss any of the videos we have playlist by the name of mission CUET 2024 you can go and check out that playlist and we have every video like part 1 part 2 part 3 and you will find each part in that particular playlist okay so uh, you can just pause the video to get to know me and if you want to hear it out from me then you can probably uh, visit to the videos of week 1 uh, and uh, you know there I am describing it in detail but right now you can just pause and read then this is my CUET scorecard everybody as I always say that CUET happened uh, in 2022 for the first time and then 2023 so I have been a CUET specialist till then uh, since uh, you know the beginning and uh, I analyzed the actual papers I created mocks which resemble the actual paper uh, almost 90% and I myself appeared for this particular exam and you can see that economics was my domain subject where I got 100 percentile that means you can trust me what I am saying that I am definitely going to help you score that 100 percentile this is the agenda of this video you can again pause and give it a read uh, so this is our syllabus money and banking uh, you can get the syllabus from this website everybody and uh, this is uh, this is it like money meaning evolution function central bank meaning and function commercial bank meaning and function if you want to take personal advice of uh, like from me this particular unit I would say is the most scoring <coughs> okay majorly a case study comes uh, from this particular uh, unit and if not then uh, you know the questions that come from this particular unit are relatively easier as compared to you know other units so this is the most scoring unit I would say then let's just uh, begin the video with the questions so what is CRR everybody uh, C cash reserve ratio so percentage of deposit a bank keeps as the cash reserve okay seems like almost the correct answer but still let's give a read to other options okay some reserves to keep in liquid form by rbi no some reserves uh some of the reserves and loans no the people keep as deposit in the house no guys so people don't keep as deposit in the house so crr is percentage of deposits a bank keeps as a cash reserve okay you can see that in the ncrt as well that crr percentage of deposit which a bank must keep as cash reserves with the bank okay so let's move to the next question what is slr guys slr kya hota hai? percentage of deposits which a bank keep no ab dekho dono almost same options hai aur dono same time pe paper mein ek hi paper mein aaye hue hain to iska matlab ye important ho jata hai theek hai so percentage of deposits which a bank must keep ye to hume pata hai crr aa rahe hai to humne pichle option mein dekh liya theek hai keeping some reserves in the liquid form in short short term in the bank okay this is the correct answer reserve of cash reserve ratio no and uh, you know buying and selling of bonds in the short term no guys so the correct answer is option number b you can read apart from crr banks also required to keep some reserves in liquid form in the short term this ratio is called statutory liquidity ratio or slr okay so then let's come to the next question identify the correct statement you need to find the correct statement everyone medium of exchange is the secondary function of money right medium of exchange is the primary function not the secondary so this statement incorrect is where you can eliminate a this is where you can this option is wrong in case of a bank assets are loans given to public okay this might be you know you can hold on to the statement but i am saying the statement is true lekin agar nahi bhi aati koi baat nahi wait commercial banks are type of institution which are part of the money creating system of the economy okay so money creating aap samajh sakta hai money create kaise karta hai commercial bank money multiplier processes so this is true commercial bank are said to be lender of last resort guys ye rbi hota hai central bank na ke commercial bank we know that D is wrong, now D will eliminate D, D is not here Then RBI sells security in the open market to decrease money supply Securities are open market operation ki baat ho rahi hai everybody And RBI is your bank, this is your market 
आर अगर मार्केट में सिक्योरिटीज दे रहा है ठीक है आप समझ लो एक पेपर दे रहा है पेपर दे रहा है इसके बदले मार्केट से वो पैसा ले रहा है ठीक है तो पैसा कम कर रहा है ना डिक्रीज कर रहा है मनी सप्लाई इट इज ट्रू ई इज ट्रू ई ट्रू है जिसमें भी ई e आ रहा है अब ई e नहीं आ रहा है इसको भी गलत कर दो बी सी तो सी इज द डिसाइडिंग फैक्टर एवरीबडी ठीक है सी इज द डिसाइडिंग फैक्टर कमर्शियल बैंक आर दाइप ऑफ इंस्टीट्यूशन विच आर पार्ट ऑफ द मनी क्रिएटिंग सिस्टम ऑफ द इकोनॉमी दैट्स ट्रू ओके नाउ रीड द एनसीआर सबसे पहले द फर्स्ट एंड फॉरमोस्ट रोल ऑफ मनी इज दैट अटैक्स एज अ मीडियम ऑफ एक्सचेंज फर्स्ट एंड फॉरमोस्ट रोल मतलब प्राइमरी रोल ओके देन यू कैन सी दैट यू नो हेयर इन द सेकेंड वन यू कैन प्रॉबली गिव इट अ रीड यू कैन पॉज एंड गिव अ रीड टू द एंटायर एन सी आर टी क्लिपिंग बट वॉट आई नीड टू शो यू इज दैट असेट ऑफ अ फर्म आर रिकॉर्डेड ऑन लेफ्ट साइड एंड लाइबिलिटीज ऑन द राइट साइड अकाउंटिंग रूल से बोथ साइड बैलेंस शीट मस्ट बी इक्वल असेट्स आर थिंग दैट फॉर्म ओके ओके so this is about the firm's asset sheet balance asset and liability of the firm okay so when man's where where is that statement okay let's just uh, hold on bank balance sheet conveniently the assets of the firms are recorded on the both side account and both side स्टेटमेंट देखो एज इट इज इट इज ट्रू गाइज इट इज ट्रू बट अगर आपको नहीं भी आती थी ना तो आपको ये पता था कि डिसाइडिंग फैक्टर सी है बी नहीं है बी को दोनों में ही आ रहा है ठीक है सो दैट्स ऑल्सो देर अगर नहीं भी आता था इट्स ओके देन रिजर्व बैंक लेंडर ऑफ लास्ट रिजॉर्ट होता है uh, uh, जो आपका सेंट्रल बैंक होता है ये भी आपके एन सी आर टी में दिया ओपन मार्केट ऑपरेशन में परचेज एंड सेल होता है वेन आर बी आई बाय गवर्नमेंट बॉन्ड इन दिन मार्केट इट पेज फॉर इट इन द चेक दिस इंक्रीज द टोटल अमाउंट ऑफ रिजर्व एंड वाइसा वर्सा वेन इट सेल्स मनी और सिक्योरिटीज तो मनी सप्लाई कम करने के लिए होता है ठीक है देन लास्ट क्वेश्चन ऑफ द डे एवरीबडी आइडेंटिफाई द इकोनॉमिक स्टेट वेयर बाय फाइनेंशियल ट्रांजेक्शन आर नॉट कनेक्टेड विद मनी इन द फॉर्म ऑफ फिजिकल बैंक नोट्स और कॉइन्स बट रादर थ्रू ट्रांसफर ऑफ डिजिटल इंफॉर्मेशन बिटवीन द पार्टीज तो डिजिटल इंफॉर्मेशन अगर जा रही है तो इसको हम क्या बोलते हैं ठीक है You can read this statement again. You have to identify economic state whereby financial transactions are not connected. Financial transaction or ये शोर है are not connected with money. Okay, in the form of physical bank notes or coins, but rather through transfer of digital information between the transacting party. This is digitalization कहते हैं, demonetization कहते हैं, cashless society कहते हैं, money free society कहते हैं. ठीक है, digitalization guys. And let's see NCERT में आपको ये कहाँ दिख रहा है? ठीक है. So uh, you can see here some countries have made an attempt to move towards an economy which use less of cash and more of digital transactions. A cashless society describes an economic state. Okay. so you can correct your answer this is a cashless society everybody not digitalization per se we think that this is digitalization that you know but we are actually moving when we are giving digital information we are exchanging the upi information and everything so what are we doing hum log sara humne online payment kar di to kya ho raha hai cashless society ki taraf move kar raha hai na so this is a cashless society the correct answer is and you can find it in the ncert a cashless society describes the economic state whereby financial transaction are not connected with money in the form of physical bank notes and coin but rather transfer of digital information okay so this is the true answer so you see even you know as teachers we also do get confused uh, so for you guys uh, you know to get confused is very normal that is why i say ncert is very important and line by line se kaise question pe ho raha aap dekh rahe ho to isliye ncert ko zarur read karo everybody isse se hame pata chala quantitative tools of controlling money supply is important and commercial bank ke roles and functions are important okay so guys i uh, if you think that you need to practice more questions with me you need to study from me then i am coming up with a course uh, which is uh, you know which will help you in scoring that 100 percentile my cuet sprint batch is beginning from 1st april and uh, i have started the enrollment process basically every monday to friday you will have classes with me 
एंड ऑनलाइन क्लास होंगी जूम पे ठीक है एंड यू विल गेट एवरी थिंग राइज एवरी सपोर्ट एवरी मटीरियल वील कम्प्लीट द कोर्स टूगेदर वील प्रैक्टिस प्रीवियस ईयर क्वेश्चन मोर लाइक बिसाइड्स वॉट इज हैपनिंग एंड वॉट यू सी ऑन यूट्यूब वील हैव मच लाइक वे मेनी मोर क्वेश्चन ऑफ प्रीवियस ईयर वील प्रैक्टिस ऑल ऑफ दोज आई विल प्रोवाइड यू विद फाइव फॉक्स एंड डिटेल एक्सप्लेनेशन एंड ऑल्सो वन ऑन वन सपोर्ट एंड टिप्स एंड यू नो एवरी टेक्निक एंड ट्रिक्स टू स्कोर दैट हंड्रेड परसेंट आई लेव एवरीबडी यू कैन पॉज एंड बीट वॉट ऑल इज देयर एंड इफ यूर इंटरेस्टेड एज आई सेड एनरोलमेंट इज ऑलरेडी स्टार्टेड यू कैन मेल इंटरेस्टेड इन सी यूटी स्प्रिंट बैच टू मी ऑन द फीमेल आई डी सो दैट आई नो यूर अ सीरियस स्टूडेंट एंड देन आई विल गिव यू माई कॉन्टैक्ट डिटेल एंड वी कैन डिस्कस दिस फर्दर ऑल्सो यू विल गेट बेनिफिट इफ यू एनरोल बिफोर फिफ्टींथ फेब्रवरी यू विल गेट अर्ली बर्ड डिस्काउंट प्लस यू विल गेट वन session with me before your board exam so that i can help you e- uh, scoring that you know good number even in your board exam all right so i hope you guys are interested you like it and thank you so much comment if you have any questions for us please like the videos please share it subscribe to the channel but most importantly i would urge you to start commenting the answers of every question to me in the comment box so that i can engage with you and if you have any doubt i can solve it with you so you know let's just engage and engage with each other in the comment section i hope you really liked it i'll see you tomorrow guys thank you so much and all the best keep preparing